Hi, I am Scott Von Holzen at scottvonholzen.com and the blog site is scottvonholzen.org. You're looking at here is Vivaldi's Winter Allegro Image 3. This is the seventh in the series I'm doing on the Four Seasons, Vivaldi's Four Seasons. A couple of things I want to point out on this that I find of interest. And I'd like to just make sure that you see what I'm up to here. Understand what I'm up to here. Each of these canvases on this, this 18 foot canvas is almost an individual piece of artwork. Each one can have its own its own style. I think I talk, spoke about this before, but I want to emphasize it's important because this is how the style is evolving here. Each of these pieces that hook together here stand alone. If you take this all apart, you can just have them as individually works of art. But together they form Vivaldi's Allegro. What keeps these, binds these canvases together is a, a little bit of the color because this is a winter painting so my colors tend across the whole canvas to kind of reflect winter more cold colors uh, not too you know in greens a lot of white of course and that's why we put the words in white here because we this winter we have where i am at there's still snow on the ground yet here so this is kind of cool here to, uh, in fact that i still uh, we're in winter here so i'm still working on, working on a winter uh, picture here but uh, each of these pieces are separate. They can be done, I work on each one as this is an individual piece of work. And, but what binds them together, of course, is this one little line here that runs across here. This, this works with the flow of the music across the whole canvas, this line right here, that binds these canvases all together. And that way, you can see the line will move up and down here because the music flows, and so the canvases are, are connected together to match that flowing up and down here. That part uh, I am going to be doing a lot in the future. In fact, when I'm thinking about it, when I do some works like maybe some rock and roll music or something like that, I can see a lot of these canvases varying a lot in color. Because they're, you know, rock, you know, it's not, it's not really based on a color theme. That's most, most rock music, obviously. But, but this Vivaldi series is, so I, I tend to use the blues and the colds in here. Another feature I like to point out, these are my eighth notes here. I love these little uh, circles here. Uh, to me, uh, the idea of that is to, uh, of course the eighth notes are kind of like little little mass and then they push the music across here, like the flow of the music. I am constantly trying to keep pushing the music across the canvas here. Well, these circles in here that go along here, along these like mass shaped objects in the back here, are kind of like, uh, to, me, to me, like bits of music. Like the eighth note is kicking off some music. So then you not only have the notes here flowing down here, you have little pieces of the music breaking off. You know, really, maybe, the, you know, even if you hear a note and a play it in a violin or a piano, that note lingers on. And, and I'm trying to do that here. I'm trying to just linger the music across the whole canvas. And I'm going to do a lot more of that with some uh, in the future. I can see that happening a lot. But I just got to develop the technique and get the feel for it. So uh, we've got a lot of work to do yet, and it'll be a few more weeks before this image is done, so here you go.